take your lacquer off. Little left flex to the feet. The other left flex to his gun. Yes. Now walk up. Tap. Exactly. Follow, follow, follow. Don't take back. Good. Now I have a little left flex because that's gone. So think about the capital C. Not a lower case. Okay. Capital C. That is less of a curse than a, a lower case. Okay. Do you see what I say? Yes. For his bend in his body. Exactly. Because you're on a 20 meter circle. You're not in a corner. A corner is a lower case C. Okay. Much sharper. Yeah? So if you make a halt, try not to make from your capital C an I. Okay. Keep the capital C in the halt. Because you're halting on the circle. Now, if your right leg was back, he would not have swung his hunches out. Okay. Yeah, no problem. So walk on. Tap. Good boy. Exactly. So when you again make a halt, keep your outside leg back to prevent him from swinging. Yeah, thank you. Good boy. And now walk on. Now keep the four in turn. And the cap will see. Good boy. Yeah. So that is a, just a little bit of a, a strictness that you have to keep because otherwise you will get confusion. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, if a horse is a little slightly bent, you make the movement so much easier, so you will free him up more, especially okay. a stiffer horse. Right. Yeah. So after this, make a nice at the center line. Make a nice. 20 meter circle right at the cross. So now you're like a twice. You're outside line. So you're there I miss the capital C again. You see what I say? Yeah. So here I need your right leg a little bit up. Right hand a little up, sorry. Little right flexion. Give him a tap because he's not forward. Again. Yes. There you go. Right hand up a little bit. Good boy. Exactly. So if you make a hop, your left leg guides him from swinging out. Your left leg, but keep the right flex. And that was too much. You overreacted. Yep. Walk on. Tap. Exactly. Right flexion a little bit. Right and up a little bit. So what you only react on what he is moving out. Don't prevent and get an opposite reaction on his in. Okay. Do you see what I say? Yes. So make a halt again and keep the capital C and respond to what you feel. That was good. Now walk up. Good boy. Yeah, do you see now? Yes. That was right good in the boy. balance line. Okay. There. So that was a good response. There. That is not enough capital C. Right luck. One more time or half. Take your leg off. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Totally take it, but he's looking left, which he shouldn't. Little right flex. Forward, forward, don't worry. Good boy. Yeah. 
That right flex in his gun. The capital C is totally gone. Right left. Forward, forwards and left. Doesn't matter if he coughs. Right forward. Yes. Watch out. Yes. There's many ways to row. Yeah? Right. You can benefit from the outside leg like it's far there. Yeah? And, and you did that. Yeah? Right. But that is not necessarily what I want. Do you see what I say? Yes. Right. That is better. This is better. Now you're less active with the outside leg. Yes. You feel? Yep. He suddenly moves freer. Right bend again. Little right left. Now go straight. Yeah. But prepare your corners. And that doesn't mean that you have to go deep. And yes, if, 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 if the lower case D is too much of a bend for him, you shave the corner up but you make a capital C now. Yeah? Okay. Then don't try to go too deep in the corner and pretend That's your outside leg again. Right leg. There you go. There you have freedom. Yep. Feel that. Yeah? And that's what you try to keep. Much better. Good. Then change direction on the diagonal. Follow, follow. No problem, but I need a little left leg here. So don't trot until I tell you. Little left leg. Left hand up a little bit. Yeah. Now push it from your left leg a little bit to the right. A little bit. Soften the right leg, because your right leg should be a little bit further back. But not on him. Okay. Back, but off. Because he's not swinging his butt out. So you can take your right leg off. But back. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Left leg again. Forward. Okay, now take that straight. Left leg forward. Come. Little bump. Yes. That should rot for now. Okay. Because you still have a tendency to drive slower. I know. <laughs> yeah? It's gotten better, but I know that I'm still conservative. Yeah, he's definitely better. He's made an improvement, but Good. you have a tendency to slow it down. Left hand a little up. I need your left leg. That's your right leg again. Like you start to make. Can you feel that? Yes. So I need you to move the rib cage into a capital C. Away from your left leg, no problem. Just keep following. Now, can you jump that a little bit more forward here? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Now, so that. Left leg a little bit. Good boy. Yes. Stay forward, stay forward. I'm assuming because he's been doing this, and I'm assuming that just when I ask him to go forward or ask for that little bit more bend, the canter is easier for him? Yes, it is easy because that's an anticipation of not, um, for him in the trot, that's stepping under is hard enough. Okay. And the canter is easier because the canter is naturally bent. Right, okay. Yeah. 
And the throb is not naturally bent because it's more symmetric in the movement. So I'm right to, when he does break that, let him keep tantric. Yeah, make first a good tantric before you ask for a good throb again. Okay. So you, you don't want to discourage that because he was actually trying to give you the bend. Right. So if you immediately say, no, don't do that, you discourage him from developing what you want to do. Right, I don't want to shut down him going forward at all. <laughs> so now right forward a little bigger. See, you have a tendency when he canters to let him decide to canter. Okay. But if he canters, encourage a little bit more forwardsness to say, okay, you maybe decided to canter, but that doesn't mean that you can get out of work. Right. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. And by riding that a little bit more forwards, you put him to work and then he will start to think twice. Okay, did I make the right choice or not? Yes. You see what I'm saying? This yes. is a nice cut right here. Yeah. Now you can ask for a trot again. But keep the bend. Soften the outside, soften the outside. Too much outside rain. Yeah, now a little left left. Almost like a yielding. There. Now take your left leg away. And that was hard for him. You can see that yeah. behind us. Yep. But that's where he needs to go. Okay. That yeah. yielding is what you're talking about, or the bend, you mean? That bend. Okay. Yes. Yeah, that's, that's hard. That. Yeah. Yep. And that is hard. He struggles, and you can see that in the hind leg. And you see that a little a bit of an irregularity, but I'm not concerned about that. Okay. That is because he has to take a longer stride. Yep. There is that. Now we go going straight. Good boy. So now go straight. But don't keep the capital C then when you go straight. Right. You see what I say? Yeah. Straight is straight. In the corners, you can remind them again. Now straight. Yes. 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 And then change direction. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. Good boy. Little right leg here. Careful for your left leg. Yes. Little half foot in the right vein. Yeah, go straight. That's nice. Now come on a circle. Good boy. I know, I know. You start to feel this? Yeah. Try it like a little bit. Absolutely. Try it like again. Right hand a little up. Left rein should give a little bit. I know you want an outside rein. Okay. But you take it the outside rein because it's been told that you have to have an outside rein. But you have to give him the opportunity to go into your outside rein. Not that you just hold it because, hold I know it because you have to have an outside <laughs> rein. Okay. That's not good, yeah? Yep. Yeah. Good boy. That's different. This feels quite normal and nice. It looks super for oh. him. For him. <laughs> there. That looks different than the last time. Awesome. Yeah, now take that straight. I'm just going to cut off this end. Yeah. So what I would like you to do from here is go straight and then you can turn nicely down the center line. Use the bend to see if you can make a very miniature yielding away from your right leg. It's no different than on a 20 meter circle. Now a little right leg. Look where you go. Don't look down. Right rein. Too much left rein. Too much left rein. Okay. Yes. Yes. Good boy. There. Let's do that again. Yes. So soften your left arm more. Little right flexion because there is no uh, capital C to be found. Now it's coming. 
Do you see what I say? Yes. Yeah, do that again. And now I want to see the capital C. Yes. Yes. Right, left. That's it. Good boy. That's it. Very good. Now go straight. Come on the diagonal. And then see carefully if you can make a miniature lengthening. Not a medium, a miniature length. Work and forward. Follow, follow. Absolutely. Down the center line. Dropping the outside way. Thank you. 